Hi, Dr. Debbie here, and I thank you for tuning in. Uh, today we're at the World Symposium of the Oral Systemic Connection in San Diego, California, and I have George Hodeman with me. Uh, he is the CEO of Oral DNA Labs. For my patients that are watching this, of course, we've embraced enthusiastically the oral DNA technology to help each and every one of you get healthier, and I am very impressed with this technology, and it's been great to get to know George. George, how did this all get started? Well, Debbie, I first of all wanted to thank you for your role in improving patient health, and that's why we're in this business, obviously. You know, there's a large problem to be solved, and that mm -hmm. is that over half of adult Americans, mm -hmm. according to the American Academy of Periodontology, mm -hmm. have gum disease. Mm -hmm. That's over 100 million Americans with periodontitis. Mm -hmm. And so the idea was to bring both bacterial tests showing pathogens in the mouth and genetic risk tests that can be used to help address mm -hmm. this large issue. Well, it has certainly worked in our practice when people have a look at their profile and see which of the pathogens they have in their mouth, especially the high-risk transmissible pathogens, which in our office we call transkissable. So that really matters because you don't want to give those pathogens to your loved ones. Um, it's really helped people to see the problem and to solve the problem, to take responsibility for their own health. So I'm very interested in just how your lab works. Well, the science behind these, uh, these tests is well established. It's been very well documented and studied that there's 11 pathogens that are well known to cause periodontal disease. Uh, four of these are in a high risk category. There's several that are in a moderate risk category and also some in the low risk category. And if you know exactly which type of pathogen mm -hmm. exists, you can tailor and personalize therapy mm -hmm. to more uh, readily address the issue, which is periodontitis. So the, uh, the, uh, the science behind this is pretty clear. There's uh, traditional methods of microbiology that have been used to culture bacteria and grow them and determine whether these exist or not. But now we have DNA testing, which is mm -hmm. much more advanced. And DNA testing allows us to extract DNA from the salivary sample through a very simple rinse. Mm -hmm. And using that extracted product, we can use a PCR technique or polymerase chain reaction, which is the state of the art for DNA analysis to identify specifically the semi-quantitative levels of these microbes. And there's also a human genetic test, mm -hmm. which we can use to mm -hmm. look at a polymorphism or a single nucleotide polymorphism called a SNP in the mm -hmm. IL-6 region, which would tend to predict whether you would have an exaggerated immune response to the presence of these pathogens. Mm -hmm. Yes, and in our practice, we really enjoyed the, the gen genome test. Uh, when we first started using this in de uh, December of 2012, we would just get a, a negative or a positive response. And now we get actually a measurement, uh, low, medium, or high, which just shows me how your lab is constantly improving on what right. you're doing. Uh, it's very user-friendly. Uh, I, I'm just very, very impressed. Is there anything else you want to tell us about well, I think a lot of uh, questions we get are, what is the, uh, what is the, uh, you know, the back office in this? Mm -hmm. And we are a national reference laboratory, and I think what's important to know is that we're bringing the rigors of the traditional clinical laboratory to the, to the dentistry marketplace and to the patients served by the dentists. A, uh, a highly uh, regulated, certified laboratory such mm -hmm. as ours is under the control of a government agency called CLIA, which is an FDA counterpart. We're also certified to a much higher level, which is the College of American Pathology. Mm -hmm. So what we will do in our laboratory is use these advanced molecular techniques with highly validated uh, test results under the supervision of pathologists and supported by genetic counselors to provide these results. So there's a, uh, there's a team behind these two mm -hmm. providing additional support and help. So this is the highest, uh, the highest standard of reporting available, and it's now available to provide uh, additional assistance to, uh, uh, to the treatment of periodontitis. Well, and it's also helped us in many areas. Uh, in my own mouth, I got tested and found that I had trypanema dentiformis, and I ended up having a root canal that was failing. And when I got that uh, tooth actually removed, unfortunately, but fortunately for my health, then uh, had an implant placed, that pat pathogen absolutely was gone at my next test. So, so we can... Uh, test for things, we can treat things, and we can know that we actually treated them and, and help the patient. And that's what we're all about is just helping people be healthier so that um, they can live more happy, abundant lives. So George, I want to thank you for taking time. And thank you, Debbie. Thank yeah. you very much for helping improve patient care.